Hello, in this video, I will show you how to install Homebrew on macOS. If you don't know Homebrew is, it's a package manager for you to install anything from command line. So you can install command line tools and also apps from outside of the macOS app store. Okay, let's just get started. The first thing to do is to install Xcode command line tools. To do that, we need to open terminal and enter the following command. Okay, you so you just need to copy the command here. To the terminal okay just paste here press enter and then a window will be show up you just need to click install there will be command line tools license agreement just scroll you can read it if you want to and then click agree and let's just wait for the software to be downloaded Okay, once it's done, the software was installed, you can click done here. Okay, the next step is to install Homebrew Package Manager. To do that, you just need to open the Homebrew official website. And then go to this part to install Homebrew. You just need to copy the code here and then open terminal again and paste it here. Then press enter. It will asking for your password. So you just need to enter the password. And then it will ask for more confirmation here. So you just need to press enter. And we have to wait. Okay. Now it's done. We need to follow the next step from the homebrew. So we need to run these two comments in the terminal to add homebrew to a path here so first we need to execute this one and just paste here and press enter and then we need to do this so we load the homebrew to our pad okay now next we can type a brew doctor to check if it's working and your system is ready to brew so homebrew is already installed successfully okay now the next step is to check it with some installation so let's uh, install the command line tool called wget this is uh, usually to for download something so you just need to type brew install wget so go back to your terminal okay I will clear it here and then here so you just need to type brew install wcat it will download the wcat from the server okay so we've successfully download the wcat from homebrew so you can use it like this so it's downloading the example.com website using wcat okay uh, other than command line tool you can also install apps like google chrome so something not not coming from the official app store to do that you just need to install like this brew install cast google chrome so go back to terminal i will make it clear and then you just type brew install dash dash cast google chrome it will download Google Chrome from the official Google website. Once finished, the Google Chrome was installed in, uh, under the application directory. So you can open it normally from the uh, spotlight. Just type Google Chrome and it's installed. So it, uh, Brew is very, uh, very useful for you to manage your uh, installation from command line so it's really more uh, tidy and more uh, efficient okay i think that's all i can show you so thanks for watching and see you around